Hello, it's Tuesday evening. I'm recording this from bed uh, before I leave tomorrow, and I will upload it just after midnight, so I will not be late with this one. Um, trying to think of something I could talk about for four minutes as opposed to just summing up my time. Mostly. I was reading E.O. Wilson's book, Letters to a Young Scientist, which is sort of about why you should pursue a career in science if you think you're interested in it. And it's interesting, but it's also making me feel really like maybe I'm not cut out for a career in science. Or not cut out to be a professor, and then what do I want to do with my life? And then if I do want to do that, what? Whether my master's degree is right for that. I don't know. And Gisela, the PhD student who I work with, is so driven to go home to Chile and be a professor. And I just... I like personal time. I like coming home and reading my own books and watching TV and having friends over and not constantly thinking about my research subject. And I like spending time with my family. And I don't like the idea of giving up everything for the sake of a career. I don't know. I guess because it's a career, I don't want that. But, but what else do I do? I don't know. It's not what it's about. the book is supposed to make you think. I mean, the book also makes me want to go study ants, but I'm sure it's supposed to be encouraging and not discouraging. But I mostly just feel discouraged right now. Anyways, um, I go to the field tomorrow again for two days, and then we're home for a little bit, and then I'm gone for ten days, and I don't know what I'm going to do while I'm gone for ten days. Maybe we can have, like, a break, or I can record some videos. I don't know, I'll have to see. It's a long time. But that's future Margaret's problem. We made homemade pizza and had my our friends Carolyn and Kat, who are studying here, over for dinner tonight, which was nice. The pizza was delicious, and then we played Munchkin, which was fun. Except much it's difficult to teach people, especially if they don't really understand RPG mechanics, so. But they got it in the end. I keep expecting a homesickness to set in, and I think it is a little bit, because my family's gone home. A feeling like, well, or the realization that we may never be, that life will never be the same as it was, and that there's no going back the comfortable sameness that I had for the last, not quite 20, well, you could say 23 years, at least since we moved into the house. So, I suppose that that might be contributing to my sense of melancholy about E.O. Wilson's book, I don't know. What I want to do with my life. I suppose that's why I'm young and get to still think about it, but it's a hard thing. Hmm. Sometimes, you know, in books where they live in like a dystopia and people's roles just get assigned to them, I sometimes wish we had that. Even though that's silly-ish. And I'd rather see colors and not have to make any choices. Anyways, see you soon.